guys, more Tales of Symphonia here. In the last part, we were just heading through Isalia Forest, and we we're coming up on this cliff area, and here we have another skit. Genus's friend. What do we got? So who's this friend that we're going to go see? Is it the one you've been giving your school lunch to? What? You knew about that. I always see you hiding food in your school bag. Yeah, she never has anything to eat, so I feel really bad. That's really cool, Genus. It's nice of you to share what little food we have. Ah, uh, it's not that big of a deal. Don't be so modest. I'm sure that dog is really thankful. What? What? Dog? She's not a dog. She's human. Oh, really? This whole time I thought I was thinking you were keeping a pet dog in secret from the professor. <laughs> Apparently not. Okay. Here's my stop. At the Design Human Ranch, don't, doesn't going there violate the non-aggression treaty? The Designs already attacked the temple. Hmm, well, yeah, I guess that's true, but I know I'm not supposed to. But there's someone I just have to tell about the Oracle. Alright, but I'm worried about you, so I'm worried about you going alone, so I'm going with you. Alright, let's get moving. Here is the first Design Human Ranch that you will encounter, obviously. Slacking off, swine. Marble. Genus, is that your friend? Yeah, I'm Lloyd. I am pleased to meet you. Marble, did you see it? There was an oracle! Yes, I did. I saw the Tower of Salvation. Now the Chosen's journey of regeneration can finally begin. I hope it is successful this time. The last Chosen failed, right? Yes, I heard the Chosen was killed by Desions during the journey. I wonder if Colette will be alright. Let us pray to Martel. May she guide the Chosen on a safe journey. Huh? Hey, uh, Grams. Her name's Marble. Marble, isn't that an X-Sphere? Oh, is that what this is called? They placed it on me shortly after I came here. Yeah, that's definitely an X-Sphere, but there's no key crest on it. An X-Sphere without a key crest is dangerous. What's a key crest? And how is it dangerous? Attaching an X-Sphere directly to your skin supposedly makes you sick. But ironically, it's useless unless you attach it directly onto the skin. So, in order to prevent it from making you sick, you carve a spell into a special ore and use that as a mount for the X-Sphere. That's the key crest. You're very knowledgeable. But it looks like Marble's X-Sphere doesn't have a mount at all. Nope, doesn't look like it. If the charm was the only thing needed, I could carve one myself, but... There's nothing I can do without the inhibitor ore that acts as the mount. There has to be something you can do, Lloyd. It's not as easy as you think. Key crests are dwarven technology. Your dad's a dwarf. Please ask him for help, Lloyd. Fine, fine. I'll ask him. All right! That's why I like you, Lloyd. Please, don't trouble yourself. Hey, old hag! What the hell you doing over there? Oh no! The designs! Run away, you two! Hurry! Okay! I'm sorry! Don't worry, just go! I'm sorry, Marble. What are you doing over here? Who said you could slack off? Get back to work! I'm sorry. What's with that look, huh? Hmm. Looks like someone's got an attitude problem. No, of course not. I... Shut up! You two, take her to the back! We're gonna give her a little lesson on respect. Yeah! Oh, this doesn't look good. They're taking her to the back. But what can we do? 
There's got to be something we can do. Let's find higher ground where we can see what's going on in there. It looks like we can go up from here. Save her. But how? You attack the designs from here with magic. What? Are we gonna get in trouble? We don't have a choice. Afterwards, hide among the bushes and make your way back to the village. I'll act as the decoy. But that'll put you in danger. Don't worry. I'll head down the cliff so they don't see my face. Then I'll run in the opposite direction from the village. Okay. You should replenish your energy before we do this. I've got some leftover cookies from the ones I gave to Colette. Here, have some. What the? Furious! Stop him! Open the main gate! Are you all right, Marble? Quickly, come this way! Genus, Lloyd, thank you. They saw your face! I'm sorry, it's all my fault! Don't worry about it. But... I took out the ones that saw my face, and the rest of them are still back up on the cliff. As long as we hurry up and get out of here, they'll never know. Oh, okay. Just do my homework for me, okay? Okay. All right then. I'm gonna head on home. You should head back to the village. Lloyd, thanks for helping Marble. Hey. That's what friends are for, right? Alright, I can talk again. That's gonna be the last talking... Or wait, hold on. Analyze the data from the gate surveillance system. Yes, sir! How did a mere human make that kind of jump? Never mind, scratch that. Received Genus's equipment. Now, remember that you just got that because he will not have it equipped, and so he'll be a little bit more vulnerable once you get it back. Okay, Apple Gel. Um, that's gonna be... That's like the longest talking cutscene that you'll get for a little while. Okay. Move, oh, good. I'm just trying to avoid some fights here. I'm running low on time. Jeez. Okay, come over here. Get this bag. I will be able to hold it. Orange gel. Okay. And then the bag reinflates. I'm gonna cut this after this skit. Restless? Noish. Say, Noish, is it just me or have you been restless ever since we left the sanctuary? What's the matter? <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do that. You weirdo. Wine, wine. I 
sound like freaking gay when I do that. Huh? What? Wine, 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 wine. I have no idea what you're trying to say. It's too bad you can't talk. It'd be funny if you could talk. It's like, hey man, what's going on? I'm a dog. Feed me stuff. Anyway, I will see you in the next part.